Hello there, Trevor here from Double Bill Movies. Yeah, I've not been around for a little while, um, just not really been in the mood. And uh, I have actually been busy, as you can see, right here. Um, these are handmade shelves, all made by me. Um, if you've seen some of my other videos that I talk about my shelving, um, and I actually did a little video on how I made the shelves. Uh, you can find that in the playlist somewhere, probably in uh, Odds and Ends. Um, yeah, just bought the material from B&Q and uh, that's the final product. Um, so, someone asked me about uh, a bit of a room tour. So I thought I'd give you a little room tour. Hope you're all surviving in this heat. Um, I think it's gonna change tomorrow. So this is Sunday night and uh i think tomorrow is going to be a bit cooler so that should be pretty nice um yeah take you around the room then shall i all right well you've seen this shelving unit before that's one that's in the back of most of my videos and uh, that's all 88 films on four shelves and the rest of my or a large chunk of my horror there then this is what I've done um, well finally got up on the wall yesterday uh, it's taken me a little while not been easy to do um, they're all 4k's and they all have sleeves on um, there's a couple in there that don't but they are about to have custom ones once I can get the order put in from James at Jam Slips but um, anyway, I have some new surround sound speakers. These are Wharfdale Diamond Edition. Um, and they actually match the surround backs there. Yes, that is a ship in a bottle and it is Lego. <laughs> um, so that was the... Um, the first unit I built and that's the second one I did that's got uh, all my arrow stuff in it and a few cool box sets on top more box sets up there and this is where the bulk of my collection is um, sorry about that got myself caught there's all sorts of uh, Disney and whatnot there. Um, and then I think we've got 20th Century Fox. So there's 4Ks without slips. There's Warner Brothers. Um, where else is there? Oh, that's 20th Century Fox. Then World War II. Then a whole bunch of stacks. Which were, if I get out of my own light, which were all in front of here. Um, but I'm glad to now get them out of the way. That's a little Lego set we're building. And um, these are some of the Lego sets that I have. Yeah, we've got a lot of Lego, by the way. <laughs> so there's um, Dio from Rogue One. Is it Rogue One? Dio from one of the Star Wars films. There's a, a Hoth a probe droid. And if you can see Vader's chamber. And of course we know what that is. It's a big TIE fighter. Um, and there is a 3D printed Lego figure that my boss did for me. Uh, that's a cool set. That's called Everybody is Awesome. Um, obviously in the, in the pride colors then those of you who've seen um what was it the mandalorian that's from that where luke comes in and um does his thing <laughs> and those books they're harry potter um all right let's get a bit less wobbly so <clears throat> these are my main speakers, they are Mordant Short, um, 
metal floor standards, obviously. Um, so back there we've got Stingray, Blu-ray box set. My 4K Star Wars, very limited edition. Some other box sets and things here. A whole load of DVDs. As you just quickly saw, Watchmen, Nine, um, and Blade Runner. 2014, um, no, is it <laughs> 2049? I, I haven't seen it yet. That's also Lego, that's the International Space Station. Uh, very cool Lego set that is. My PS3, and of course, my home cinema setup. And my lovely, lovely, lovely Pioneer TV. And of course, up there is my screen. Um, so if I come over here, more DVDs. So that big one there is Tinker Tailor's Soldier Spy. And uh, you got Pacific, there's a uh, Star Wars DVD set, John Wayne box set, and of course, Century Warfare, the, the set that I worked on when I was at Testronic. Um, more box sets there, Jurassic Park, Back to the Future, these are Blu-ray obviously. And um, got more World War II stuff. Uh, another Lego set here. I think you all recognize what that is. It's the Lunar Lander. The Eagle has landed. My Reservoir Dogs um, gasoline tin. And my Mad Max gasoline tin. James Bond box set, which I also worked on at Testronic. And my Marvel Phase 1 Tesseract case. My other speaker. And my huge but wonderful subwoofer. There's my World War II calendar. And there's a nice um, Cinema Lobby Saving Private Ryan poster. Come over here, there's my kitchen. Um, some World War II posters, posters, paintings. Those four are just cut out of magazines. But um, yes, my other surround speaker. And that's basically it. So there we go. I haven't really gone anywhere. Just uh, been busy um, and trying to find the mood <laughs> to do some content. So I hope you like my new shelving unit. Like I said, go into my um, playlists and look up my odds and ends playlist and you'll find out how I made those shelves. Uh, Anyway, just a little short video to say hi. Uh, I'll see you again soon.